Hey you guys, it's Elise. Welcome to my channel if you're new. And if you are not new, then welcome back to my channel for another video. Hey guys, so with winter being basically right around the corner, actually, you know what? Let me scratch that. Winter is basically already here. So I wanted to pop by a Wally World. You guys, y'all ever heard that song? I don't know. I don't know if y'all ever heard that song. I think it was viral, but like where all the girls were twerking going, Wally, 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 Wally World. Every time I say Wally World, it makes me think of those girls twerking. Look up Wally World twerking, okay? I wanted to pop by good old Walmart to see what they had for winter attire and what they were gonna be serving us for this fine holiday, holla slay season. I'm gonna be trying everything on per usual. That's pretty much how these at the dressing room videos go. So anyways, if you guys wanna see what items Walmart has for winter, then of course, please keep watching. So before anything, I do wanna point out that Walmart just has all the goods. If you are looking for an ugly Christmas sweater, or you're looking for an even an ugly Christmas sweater type of dress, anything related to Christmas, Walmart is the place you gotta hit up. They had some of the coolest looking sweaters. I even saw one with Will Ferrell's face on it. I saw a ton with little pom-poms. Listen, y'all, if you are looking for an ugly Christmas sweater, Walmart is the place you have to hit up, okay? You're gonna have to thank me later on that one. All right, guys, so the first, sir, sir, can I help you? If you're gonna be a good boy, you can stay, but if you're gonna be wild, you're gonna have to get out. Leave the, leave the lamp alone. What did this lamp ever do to you, Sushi? In the past, I did purchase things from Walmart, but I always felt like they weren't the best quality. But I've noticed that up until recently, they really, really have upped their game when it comes to their clothing. And they have this new brand that I actually have never noticed, and it's called Time & True. A lot of the pieces that I am trying on in this video were from that Time & True brand. This is the first one right here. I absolutely loved this cardigan. It is like a long, thick, double knit cardigan. It's checkered, and it's beautiful. I really love this sweater because you can kind of throw it over your shoulder you can wear it and kind of cover it up if you are feeling a little bit bloated then sis do not worry you can wear this and kind of throw it over hide any little chichos any little guts or you can wear it to the holiday party and girl if you are fixing to eat and have a good meal then you don't have to worry because this is gonna cover you all the way up absolutely love the print on it I think it is perfect for the season nonetheless it is also really 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 warm so that's perfect for the winter it's nice and long it does go down to my knees but guys keep in mind I'm only five feet tall so I'm a short but I love it. I thought it was so pretty and this one was $22.86. I would normally say this is a little bit pricey but where this was such a thick cardigan I do see why it's a little bit more up there in price but, but nonetheless this was a really really nice piece. So one thing that I will say Walmart was lacking in was in dresses. The only dress that I really found that I kind of liked was this one right here and this is kind of like a snake print relaxed fit dress again by the brand Time and True. And what I liked about it was that it was a button up. It was definitely a thinner type of chiffon almost material but it was was nice because it was something that I wouldn't typically wear but I wanted to try it on just for the heck of it because it was a dress and I didn't really have any dresses to try on but I thought this piece was cute I really didn't think it would look nice on me because anytime I try dresses on like this I feel like it just doesn't work out but I do think it was cute if I was to wear this dress I would definitely not button it all the way to the top leave some buttons open kind of show a little bit of cleave a little bit of skin I really like the fact that this had a little tie at the waist to help you cinch it in if you guys watch my tips and tricks to a smaller waist video then you guys know that wearing a belt is just a must and to be completely honest I wasn't down to spend 20 bucks on this dress that's just me but I don't think it was an ugly dress at all I just think it's for somebody else to be honest I'm trying on this knit sweater by no boundaries and as you guys can see I don't know what kind of print it is exactly it kind of has some stripes has some triangles it has a lot of print going on but I thought this was really nice because it almost looks like a festive type of sweater I like the colors that it has as well and I definitely snagged this up I mean you guys this was only five dollars and it originally was 16 almost so I mean if that's not a steal I honestly do not know what is I thought it would be nice to wear it for work maybe on a casual Friday with some jeans or something it is times like this where you just gotta love Walmart five dollars for this little cute sweater yes please so again by the brand time and true this is another cardigan this is another kind of like ribbed cardigan this one is long like the other one that I tried on but this one has pockets I really really like this cardigan same deal you can kind of throw it over your shoulder you can wear it to kind of cover up everything this one was $18.88 just so just a little bit shy of $20 these are just really perfect layering pieces which I definitely think Walmart was absolutely winning in they had so many nice sweaters to choose from and cardigans now for another piece that is a little bit more sassy if you will darling this one was by the brand no boundaries and this is just a really beautiful cheetah print cheetah licious faux fur type of jacket I love it I thought it was really pretty now the only reason I did not grab it is because I would have liked a bigger size just because I really kind of like stuff like this to be a little bit more oversized and a little bit more slouchy so the fact that it was just like 
my exact size was the only reason that I didn't grab it. But this was so cute and I definitely see it being something that I would totally wear in the winter time because it was so comfy, so cozy, and so sassy. So I absolutely love this. So here I have this camel colored duster. This one was also on clearance and I got it for $11. So girl, y'all know I cannot pass up a good deal. The minute I see a good deal, I'm like, nope, need to have it. I don't want to hear it. I gotta take it home. It's definitely perfect for the office and it's also perfect for the days where you just don't exactly know what you want to wear but it's kind of chilly out so you can just kind of like pair just a regular tank top some jeans and kind of throw this over it and your outfit will look put together the way that I tried it on definitely did a disservice to it because this is a lot cuter than it looked on I totally had the wrong shirt underneath it but I thought this was so cute and I cannot wait to style this teddy sweaters teddy jackets let me tell you guys Walmart is definitely booming so many zip up sweaters so many actual jackets that are all that teddy style which is that like floofy type of material I absolutely love the one that I tried on as you guys can see it's kind of like a gray on the top and then like creamy towards the bottom it's a two-tone teddy jacket but I thought this was so cute and so comfy it was only like 20 to 22 dollars which I thought was a really good deal compared to some of these other sites where you try to buy the stuff from and it's like upwards of like 40 dollars so I thought this was so cute and I could not pass it up and this is such a cute cozy sweater and I cannot wait to wear this all winter long I'm probably gonna live in this not gonna lie I, I mean I probably Probably, yeah. So next up I have this pink v-neck long sweater. So I didn't totally love this one and I did pass on it because of the fact that I didn't totally love the material and I didn't love the fit either and I also felt like for some reason the stitching was off. If you guys can see on the sides it's like the stitching is it almost makes it look like the shirt is inside out. So I didn't totally love the way that this shirt was made so I ended up passing on it. Alright guys, so the next one by No Boundaries is a very similar piece kind of to that pink v-neck sweater. But except the next one I have is a little bit of a better material and it's also a better price as well. It's actually the one that I'm wearing right now, so obviously I did pick it up. It's this ribbed type of cozy sweater. I absolutely love the fit on it. It's a little bit high-low, so on the back it will cover your butt a little bit if you want to wear leggings with it. But it's still really, really comfy and cozy and it was on clearance for 9 bucks. So of course, I couldn't say no to that. I already worn it twice. No shame. I love it. I had never tried Walmart denim up until now. So this is by the time in True Brand. These were $18.74. And this is kind of like a dark wash denim. So I didn't love the fit on them. I feel like the pockets were placed in a strange way. Like they were up too high and it almost made my butt look weird. So I ended up passing on the pants. They, However, I will say they were very stretchy. So I really liked that. They seemed like they were a good material. I just wasn't a fan of where the pockets were placed. And these were high waisted as well. Extremely picky with jeans. So let me tell you. This comes as no surprise, the fact that I'm picking on the pockets because I will literally not buy jeans because of the way that my butt looks, okay? I literally won't. If the booty don't look nice, I don't want it. So this shirt I did find on clearance as well. Now, I liked the idea of this shirt. It almost seemed like it was a little bit of a sweetheart neckline um, because it had like that little souping right here on the cleavage area and it seemed like it would kind of cinch a little bit nicer towards the bottom. So this was a cute shirt. The only thing is I just didn't love the color. I wasn't crazy about it and I already have so much mustard in my closet right now like so much and I actually don't want to keep buying so many mustard things so I ended up passing on it even though it was so affordable and such a good deal but in another situation I would have bought this shirt if, maybe if I found like a red one or something I would have got it but, all right guys so there you have it those are the items that I wanted to share with you guys from Walmart I hope this video inspires you to go to your local Walmart and check out what they have for clothing items for the season I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you all so much for watching don't forget to let me know in the comments down below what your favorite piece that I tried on was and of course don't forget to thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already check out my other at the dressing room videos which I will have around here for you guys to check out I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in my next one Mwah.